1996, where there's always going to be stats like that for a little while longer. But what does this mean to you going forward? Well, it's uh, exciting, and we're you know proud. Of, I'm proud of the kids for uh, you know playing as hard as they played. Uh, there were some uh, times in there that that uh, I was beginning to wonder if it was going to fade away. But the kids found a way to to, to win, and uh, block field goals were huge, obviously. Uh, and I thought uh, Pete Fleps uh, being able to see the guy on fourth down, you know, didn't run all the way off the field on the trick play. Uh, it was big. We've been talking about that all week, you know, that kind of stuff. And, and uh, you know, sure enough, they tried to do it, and, and he saw it. So that was good. Uh, I thought Kyle played, you know, good at times. Uh, you know, he'll get better watching the tape. Uh, but he made, made some plays and made some throws, and, and uh, that scramble on the uh, – we, we whiffed uh, on a guy on the third down play and he couldn't, couldn't get the ball out. We had two guys running wide open, but he couldn't get it out. At least he pulled it down and ran for the first down, which was big. Yeah, that drive was clutch. Just, you know, we had to run out the whole clock over six minutes. Yeah. About what, what else was key on that drive? Well, um, I, you know, I told the guys before going out, if they want to be champions, they got this is what you got to do. You got to be able to take the ball down and put it in the end zone and end the, end the game right now. And, we were we were talking about throwing for another touchdown. I threw for one, tried to throw for one, and really had a shot, but he threw it a little earlier than he wanted to. Uh, but uh, you know, I, I was glad we were able to convert the first first downs and keep the clock going. You, you touched on Kyle's performance. The offense had uh, almost 500 yards of offense, mm -hmm. but still 21 points. What's what's the key to what's um, going on there? Well, we had, uh, when we look at the film, uh, you'll see that we had certainly chances to, to score some more, but uh, we just, you know, you got to be consistent and, and go through, you know, and do, you know, see it correctly and, you know, execute it. And we didn't do that in, in some critical times. There. I don't know what our red zone was uh, down there, but, but uh, we didn't have it many times down in there, I don't think. Uh, we were good from 20 to 20, but we we didn't get many chances once we got inside the 20 yard line. And I know we've talked about blocking field goals before, but besides Margus and his special skills, what it, I mean, this is it was I think fourth and fifth times this year, nine mm -hmm. last year. What is it that? Well, the kids take great at? pride in it. Really, to be quite honest, Taylor Thompson is is the significant player in there. He and Mar Marquise Frazier. And Grenier said, I think he got one tonight. I think, uh, you know, he's had two or three. Uh, but it, but it's the, the guys believing that they have a chance to block every kick. And uh, even though Marcus uh, is is certainly powerful and, and has a great uh, uh, range, the guy the guys around him are putting penetration on the on the players to get to get Marcus to have the movement to get through. So it's a team deal and and. Uh, you know, it's pretty pretty amazing, really. Tulsa came in averaging over 500 yards of offense, and your defense held them to almost 150 fewer. What was the key to your, I guess, your defensive game plan, your approach to trying to contain that offense? Well, I thought we did a good job uh, with the zone pressures and stuff. And then when we when we rushed three, we had the guy dead to right about four or five times, and we lost contain. We had some bus actually. Uh, we didn't have a, a looper coming around a couple times, and he scrambled away. You know, we had him dead to right in the pocket on some of the zone blitz stuff, and just completely missed him too. Uh, you know, it's, it's, it's they're going to look at the film and be feel frustrated uh, when they look at it because we could even been better, I think. Uh, but I'm proud of the front seven again is is playing very well, and uh, on the back end we made some plays today. You know, we didn't give up the big ones. I thought uh, they tried to run the slant go on the third down play. Uh, and, you know, we got back. And, and uh, you know, they got some talented receivers. And uh, the back end played pretty, pretty good. They did their assignments.